What is up, please, your boy Nasa KD hit another I'm back again with another great video. If you guys watch the always tune in. Yo, it's been a while since you know I made a video. Me talking, me spinning game, me doing my thing, you know. Yeah, I just been, you know, enjoying these dance videos, you know, my shorts and also these rap freestyles, you know. This year, you know, I'm I'm gonna come with the smoke this year, you know. I'll be freestyling, I'll be rapping, I'll be I'ma turn into a whole MC this year, I promise, you know. More to come, you know, from that side, you know. Eventually, we're going to do bigger and greater things, as always. That's my mission. You know, that, that that's that's what I love to do, rap and dance and flip, flip the pair of them, you know. Give it to you back to back to back. Obviously, big up to, you know, the new subscribers that just subscribed to the channel. You know, hope you enjoy my content. You know, you've made the right decision. You've made the right decision to subscribe to this channel. Trust me, you have. You have. So, more in it. But anyway... <clears throat> I just wanted to quickly, you know, chop up about the whole Chris Rock and Will Smith situation and the Oscars. Because, like, social media has gone crazy about, you know, what happened. About the situation, the scenario. Social media is going insane. Like, literally. Like, everyone knows about it. Every single person knows about it. And, yeah, I mean, I, I just want to, you know, chop up and give my side of how I feel, you know, the situation was was like and you know you, you just give you a whole inside of you know my perspective of it obviously because he quickly explained it you know obviously you know chris Hawk might, might have said a joke he said a joke about you know will smith's wife at the oscars because chris Hawk was one of the hosts he must have said a joke about his wife and you know will smith you know he was like what the fuck he just stood up and this he just slapped chris Hawk across the face and just went back and you know, yelling and everything, you know, getting angry, blah, blah, blah. And yeah, I mean, at first it was it was pretty shocking because I remember when I saw the clip, I was like, hmm, strange. Is this stage or what? I think all of us are thinking about that. But <clears throat> the thing about the scenario is that, you know, much, obviously, the, the, this is my edition of it, you know, much respect to Chris Rock, though, honestly. Much respect to Chris Rock, cause like the way the way he handled it, he deserves you know his flowers for the way he handled that. Cause like in that scenario where, was obviously you know the two two guys you know they're they're well known in Hollywood. They're actors. They've done uh, multiple movies. They they um blew up around the same time in like the nineties two thousands. You know that era. You know they are both you know have amazing careers. Like a real, real professional dude. I really respect Crucial for the way he handled it because he wasn't he wasn't into his emotions, and I and, and that's one thing you know. Be, being being a man, a male, you must be able to control your emotions. You must be able to you know control how you feel and everything. That's what Crucial did in that situation. You know, instead of him back, you know, getting angry, you know, um, starting a fight, which. Would have been even worse, you know. Chris Rock was like, "Let me just handle this one on TV. This is my job, you know. Let me act professional." That's the way Chris Rock handled it, and that's that, must respect to that because, like, you know, I'm so you know these two, they're, they're probably friends. They, they they probably know each other. Like they, they they speak because they're in the same business. They're both comedians. They're both funny guys. They're both actors, so they speak. They they spoken before. Like they they've been personal, you know, spoken and. Spend time with each other, and for the way Chris to handle this, like in front of everyone, bro, he he really, you know, he he held it down, and yeah, I mean, through this scenario, what I've learned is that you know, um, <clears throat> yeah, I mean, it was unexpected, but it's to always, you know, remain, remain professional, you know, remain, you know, um, don't, don't let your emotions control you too much, especially for, especially for Will, like for Will was like, you know. Like, it was the emotions, you know. Like, I know, like, being famous is tough. You know, having fame is tough. People always targeting you. You're always getting spoken about every second. There's a lot to consume, and you need to be prepared for that. And that's why with me, you know, you know, when fame comes and all that, I'll be prepared. So if, if anyone has anything to say, I, I already know how to react and prepare myself for that. But that's one thing, you know, people need to realize that, you know, Obviously, being famous comes with a cost. You know, you're all gonna get backlash. You're all gonna get laughed at. But you know, but you, you as a man, you know, you, you really need to find your way of dealing with it. 
Cause at the end of the day, they they those people weren't there when you were grinding. They wasn't there from day one. They wasn't there when you know when times were tough. So if some if some guy, if some random guy came up to me and I grinded about ten years to be where I'm at and he has something to say, I would even get I, I, I really wouldn't give no two fucks about what they have to say about me. Cause I, I'm like, you know, I made it. You I over I over know you. So Come on, bro. The, 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 don't don't ring that here, fam. I'm fa- I, I'm living my dream. I'm living my best life. Look at you, bro. The, 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 that's the type of mentality, you know, to have in that field of you know being Will Smith. Cause this is Will. This is Will Smith. Everyone knows who Will Smith is, and amazing actor and everything. But yeah, but yeah, but <clears throat> it happened. You know, it is what it is. But. I feel like the the main lesson that we all can learn is that control your emotions. That the way Chris handled it was he handled it like a real G, like a real real dude would handle it. He was he was the real man. So much respect to Chris for the way he handled it. You know that's the prime example of how everyone should handle you know situations like that. Especially men like you're supposed to be controlling how we feel and not being all up in our emotions. And for wolves that like, you know <clears throat> like. People that are famous and that we really need to, you know, learn how to just ignore, you know, the steeple comes because they're relevant at the end of the day. I make money, you don't. But anyway, it's been a boy and I say kid hitting as I wanted to wrap this up, you know. More content is coming, don't see everything, and yeah, emotions is everything. We all have emotions, but it's about how we control them. Are we gonna let you know the words of others get to us? No way. I'm not. I'm not. You shouldn't have her. Stay legendary.